video is about a great place to visit and have a great, unique experience, the Suhatcha Narrow Gauge Museum. It is located west of Warsaw in Suhatcha, Poland. The Suhatcha Narrow Gauge Train Museum presents you two distinct attractions. The first is a very large, interesting, and well-maintained collection of narrow gauge steam engines and cars. The second is a train ride on a narrow gauge line powered normally by a narrow gauge diesel engine and on special occasions a narrow gauge steam engine. We have a separate video on the narrow gauge train ride in a link to which you will find in the information below this video. But we do have a very short trailer in this video that gives you a little bit of information. In addition to the outdoor exhibition of cars and engines, in the reception area, there are other rooms filled with memorabilia and more information about the Hotchiff narrow gauge line. The museum continues to collect and renovate engines and cars from the remnants of the once vast network of narrow gauge train lines and factories in Poland. The main cross country steam lines using standard gauge track can be likened to the arteries of the country. The narrow gauge lines can be likened to veins that delivered product to the arteries. Additionally, narrow gauge engines were used at many plants such as sugar mills and steel mills. The operating engines consist of the LXD2 that you see in the trailer in this video, and the operating steam engines include a PX29. These fully refurbished engines are not available for display. They are kept in separate engine sheds. You can see them when they are used to power the tourist train lines. This train museum is part of the Warsaw Train Museum. And again, we have a separate video related to the Warsaw Train Museum. A link to that video is also in the information below. Access to the Sohatchev Museum is very simple. It is about 45 minutes west of Warsaw by car. You can also reach it by commuter chain from the Warsaw Center. That's about it for now. I hope it is informative and that you can take the time to visit the museum. Now, I want to hear from you. I want to know what you think of this video and what can be changed or added to this information. And if you can add some ideas, please do. Leave everything in the comments below for everyone to read. I will read them all and respond quickly. If you are not subscribed, to the World of Rails channel yet, you are definitely going to want to do that so you don't miss anything. Just click on the subscribe button and click on the bell too so that YouTube notifies you when new information is posted. Thank you for watching and do take the time to look at the information below.